So for this tutorial, we're going to look at a video database. I really want you to get as much experience with using our databases as possible through this class. So here I am, starting off the library page, databases and new resources. Under general, there is classroom video on demand. So this is a place you can go to find videos on your subject, and it's a fairly general um, source. So I've already been logged in today, so you're going to be prompted to log in. And notice we have a search box here. You can also look by subjects. But I'm going to see um, what I can find on sugar and health. And notice it's giving me an option to search by title, segments, or actually the transcripts. I'm going to just keep it by segments and see what happens. So notice I have 15 segments. The segments is a small portion of a video. So it tells me here it's from this title. You notice, but these are different segments within it. So if I click on this um, segment, <coughs> it brings me to the exact portion. So I may, for my research project, only need to listen to a few minutes to get that information. So I also have talked a lot, emphasized a lot about toolbars. We have a toolbar right here which actually gives you the transcript. If you're looking for videos that are related to this topic, they usually have some suggestions here. Okay. So if we scroll down to right underneath the video, notice you have another toolbar where you can email it to yourself. You can create an account, I wouldn't worry about these two, but um, here is your citation. So go ahead and click on that. Now, I'm going to show you two ways to do this. You know the first way, which is copying the citation and going to, here I am in my sugar, going all 59 options and then write paste citation, so that's one option. Now, if I am in my, if I'm logged into EasyBib on Classroom Video On Demand, you'll notice there's an export, but I need to be in my project folder. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that export button. So here I am, making sure I see my project folder name, and notice everything is filled in for me. And I'm gonna go ahead and create my citation, and there we go. That citation has been added to my, let's, there it is, and it's film online video. So go ahead and search for a video and then try the export feature in this database and let me know if you have any questions.